The exerciser can get on Flex Strider and perform a motion that they're very comfortable with, something that they are very familiar with. There's nothing else in the market that caters to the, the user's natural motion for running quite the way that Flex Strider does. We've never done anything like to this level, I would say. We're allowing the user to do a running motion, doing it with a full stride, longer than most of our crop products do today, and then do it with low impact. The motion is what the user does. So that's new invention, that's, that's change. When you first get on it, some people may almost try to fight it because they're so used to the other machines that are out there. Once you start thinking more like you're running in the air, running on clouds, uh, then you start to almost relax and you get into a good stride. Initially, we were looking at our existing elevation cross trainer as inspiration for the ellipse and, and the way that we wanted the product to move. The TikTok design was something that was brought up to see if we could use that same mechanism that we use on the cross trainer for this. And from the first prototype, we ran with that design. We go through a larger range of motion. Uh, and that stretches out the hip flexors and the, the muscles in that area of your body, which is something that is really important right now as a majority of our user base is sitting all day. This was not designed to be a stepper machine. You can do stepping motion on it. If you optimize it to be a stepping machine, you're sacrificing the feel in the other stride lengths. So this is really optimized and evolved into what feels more like a running machine. It was important to Life Fitness that we create these motions that are natural, that we study what those natural motions actually are, and then make sure that we recreate those in the products that we give our customers.